Hey guys, welcome back to another. Oh, wait, I'm starting over. <laughs> okay. Hey guys, it's Endeavor. Welcome back to another video. Today we are doing St. Elmo's Fire. I keep. I kept. I kept. Kept. I keep kept. I kept wanting to say flare instead of fire. Uh, this is Man in Motion. I think that's the movie name. I know that this is a song. Um, like for the soundtrack of a movie and I also know that there are some uh, big names back for in the 80s in this. I think this will probably just be movie clips. I tend to see that happen with the soundtrack one so I'm just excited to watch. Very 80s. Just the music. Very movie-like too, you know? You know what I'm saying? Yeah. I like his voice. Oh, they're graduating college. Or high school. Oh, I actually really like his voice. College, I think, because I saw the the paternity. It's his voice is raspy just enough. These look so fun. Why did I have to be born so late? <laughs> oh, okay, so I was wrong. This isn't really just movie scenes. Is he in the movie too, the singer? No? Very catchy. Maybe. Where are they? Oh, he looks like he, I feel like he's a good performer. looks familiar. The one in the middle with the short blonde bob. Same with that guy on the right with the pink shirt. This is catchy. Yeah. Man in motion. I get it now. Yeah, him. Who is he? I've seen him. Oh my gosh, he was in Fast and Furious movies. Maybe. Her too. Where's she from? Gosh. The fade out, yes. 
Okay, so I recognized a few people, but I don't know their names or anything. I feel like I I need to look up the cast after this or else it's gonna mess with me the whole day. But anyway, I really liked the song. I thought his voice was amazing. Um, it was very, the music was very epic, like just movie soundtrack worthy, you know what I mean? Oh, it, no, it reminds me of that, that one, that one song, Electric Dreams, where it's like, feeling an electric dream. I forgot how it goes, <laughs> but do you know what I'm talking about? It just kind of has that same, like, that same spark. <laughs> I don't know. If y'all know what I'm talking about, leave it in the comments, please. But it just kind of, or like Journey, you know how Journey is kind of like big, like the, the orchestra thing, you know what I'm saying? Um, yes, but I really liked it. I thought his voice was great. It was raspy in just the right areas. He was he was getting into it. Um, he can really belt. Uh, great singer. Uh, he was also like, excuse me, an actor too. I don't know. Uh, they, I liked how they made the movie flow to where it kind of looked like they were all in the movie. Like him singing could be part of like the movie clip. Uh, I don't know, I just thought that was cool because usually in movies like this you can definitely, it's either there's no singer and it's just movie clips or it like bounces back and forth but you can really tell. It just kind of looked like he was in the same set. I really liked how they did that. Um, but this very upbeat, it's something that you could get ready for. I feel like if I was uh, a teenager in the 80s that would be like jamming to this song. Hmm, where would be a, like a good place for this song? I always say car. I don't think car for this one. Dude, I don't know. I don't know. Uh, very movie-like, which I really liked. So anyways, let me know what y'all thought in the comments. Does John Parr have any other uh, songs in big movies like this. Maybe I'll have to watch this movie because the cast looks pretty great. So anyways guys, make sure to like and subscribe and we'll see y'all next time. Bye!